What's going on, Hit Squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all lost jewelry, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Wednesday, April 14th, and as I say, each and every video smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way and if you're watching just browsing just checking out the channel just checking out the cycles just checking out the cycles me in general my microphone is falling once again Ugh. to um <laughs> make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button technical difficulties right now make sure you guys smash that th <laughs> thumbs up button and if you're um, also subscribe to the channel because I post videos each and every day with and without technical difficulties uh, if you guys want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video be sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Hitman Miyagi YT how to spell that will be in the hashtag below the video and in the description box below along with the cycles and a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils speaking of madame nazar let's get to madame nazar which if you have been looking at the map she's right up here in roanoke ridge ansberg location almost near brandywine drop how i personally get to her when she's in this location is I'll simply just run to her from my moonshine shot, which is like right here. So let's see. See that little line? Just, it's not that far of a run. I mean, if you play the game, you kind of used to traveling. So <laughs> it's a little scenery. You can get a three star cougar along the way up in here somewhere. But yeah, that's how I get to her personally. My personal preference but if you're not in the area or if this is not your moonshine shack you could just fast travel to Ansberg, which should put you around the post office which is around this area somewhere right here and then just run up from there i'm not a fan of all these curves so i just i'll either if if i'm not at my moonshine shack i'll take the train tracks up and go down from there i'll do all that just to get to her uh, because it's easier it's more of straight shots straight lines I don't like to do all that zigzagging with the horse and you end up running into one of the NPCs and next thing you know you got the the lawman out to you uh, I'm not a fan of all that so <laughs> I'll just go all the way around to be honest but she's there she will be there until 2 a.m. that's Eastern Standard Time New York Time Zone East Coast Time Zone for those of you who don't know or not of America and when she does change, I will post it on the Instagram and Twitter for the channel. Uh, let's go down here to where we... Matter of fact, the Caribbean rum. Let's get to the Caribbean rum. The Caribbean rum for today is in Blackwater. Right here, inside this tent. Right here. This tent right in the back on a crate, I think. Or, or a barrel. Right in the back of that tent, you will find your Caribbean rum, which is a antique alcohol bottle. People use that for the moonshine shack. There are a couple other things that are in black water while you're over here, which one is a tarot card and the other is a family heirloom. The tarot card is right here, right behind the bounty board, right at this location on a stack of crates. And it's in down this alley on a stack of crates. It's... It's like two crates kind of stacked up like about as tall as your, your character but it's a seven of pinnacles at that location and right here on the street right in front of this building inside a box i don't know what it is it's, it's a chest but it's an ivory comb right here in front of the um, photo studio but that's a family heirloom Let's go over here to where we usually do business. And 
the cycles for today are, or today, Wednesday, April 14th are, Family Heirloom, Cycle 6, All Azuri, Cycle 6, Coin, Cycle 4, Arrowhead, Cycle 5, Wildflower, Cycle 3, anti Gagua Bottle, Cycle 4, All Terror Card, Cycle 2, Bird Egg, Cycle 1, and Fossil, Cycle 6. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles will be down there written out. A link to a video for the current cycle of fossils will be down there. And how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel will be down there as well. Let's get to the things that we will find across the Lemoyne area of the map. Which let's start at the most top, which is up there near Blue Water. Uh, right up, right up here. Uh, there's a bird egg over here. This bird egg that's about right here, it doesn't really. Uh, it's it's glitched out, but if you want to try to get it, it's an egg egg. It's in a tree. Shoot it down with the varmint rifle or a bow. Sometimes you may have problems. Sometimes you may actually get it, but. This bird egg is a egret egg, E-G-R-E-T. I think I said that once. But if it doesn't, if you can't get it, I think if you switch lobbies, try again, or switch lobbies again and try with your bounty wagon, I think. Try to grab it with that, and then you may actually can get it then. That's another thing. But on to our next marker, which is a random fossil this random fossil is right here at this location between the a and t of blue water come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get on this island over here you will uh get a blood flower if you come over here between the time of 5 oh no 10 p.m and 5 a.m you will get a blood flower right here at that waypoint so go and get that if you can um, let's go down here to our next marker. Right here at our next marker, you will find a random coin. It's right here near a couple of trees, but there's like one, I guess, long stick of a tree. Right here at this location, right at the base of that tree, that's where you will find your random coin. Remember with the coins, you do need your metal detector. So when you come in this area, grab that. Let's go over to our next marker, which is right here under in under the N and NWA. Right here inside this home or shack, you will find a Durant Pearl bracelet, which is a lost jury. This lost jury is on top of the fireplace, so go grab that. Once again, that's a Durant Pearl bracelet, lost jury. There's are there are also or there's also another. A uh, random lost jury right about here. Right about this location with the... Is it right there? Yeah. It's about right here. I'm trying to be specific and I don't have to. But right here at this location, you will find a random lost jury. Come over here near the skull altar. You should see like a stack of skulls um, sticking out of the ground or whatever. Like a whole bunch of them. And right there to the left of it with your metal detector, that's where you will get your random lost jury from. Also, in this little shack right here, this square, you will find a tarot card, which is on the table. And it's a four of wands. Uh, let's go up a little bit to this next marker, which is a random arrowhead. It's right at the base of a tree right here on this little island. So go get that as well. Let's continue moving over to our left, which right here at our next marker is a fossil. Right here at this location, come over here with your metal detector once again, and that's what you will get, a random fossil. Let's go over to our next marker, which is a bird egg. This bird egg is a heron egg, H-E-R-O-N. It's in the tree. Shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Let's go all the way over here to our right, almost, right here at this location behind this mansion. Right here at this exact location, you will find a family heirloom. This family heirloom 
is let's zoom in a little bit more where you can see things right here at this location there's a bench right here on the i guess right in front of the stairway right because there's a bench here and there's a bench here and on this bench where the marker is you will find an ebony hairbrush ebony hairbrush which is a family heirloom right here at this location let's go over a little bit more to the cemetery right here at this location you will find a knight of wands tarot card right here inside the mausoleum at this location there's also a couple things right here outside of gus inside the treasure chest you will find a family heirloom which is a boxwood comb and a large treasure chest sitting on the ground right on the other side of the statue between you and gus right here if you come to this location uh let's go over about right here which when that's there there's another uh, there's another family heirloom which sits down this alley on the ground floor right behind the ladder do not go up the ladder there's a bench right behind the ladder and on that bench sits a tortoiseshell comb which is once again a family heirloom let's go over here to our next marker which is a antique alcohol bottle this antique alcohol bottle is a Tennessee whiskey bottle. It's sitting on a crate in the middle of this tunnel that's underneath the train track. So how you get there Get there is right here, you should see a gate. Go through the double gate and hop on this platform right here. You hop on this platform, you should see an entrance into the building about right here. When you go inside that entrance it looked like it, it's going into the building but it's a path that leads or leads to a tunnel and underground and this underground tunnel leads you to the antique alcohol bottle which is about right here and grab it off the crate the very large crate that sits right in the middle of the tunnel basically and once again that is a tennessee whiskey bottle let's go up matter of fact there's a tarot card super close to this location, like right, I want to say it's right here, but it's like right here, I think. On a boat, there's a king or there's a knight of pentacles right about here. It's on um, the part of the boat that's right here at this location is docked, so you don't really have to go out in the ocean, but it's you can jump on it from the the dock right here once again that is a knight of pentacles let's go up to our next marker which is a family heirloom this family heirloom you have to dig for which is in, in a pile of trash right here at this location and this item is a card wooden hairpin which once again is a family heirloom let's go up to our next marker which is a random lost jury this random lost jury is by the base of a large tree that's in the, this backyard of this house right here around the base of this large tree come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will get uh there's a tarot card right about i think it's right here i'd say it's like right here there's a little stairway that goes up and right on like the railing of the stairway you will get a King of Cups tarot card. That's one of the ones that I usually have to get when it's in that area because it's like one of the ones that I always need. But let's go to our next marker, which is the Caribbean, not the Caribbean rum. It's the Cardinal Flower that spawns over here in this area that helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on for the day. And let's zoom in on that one more time so you guys can see exactly where it is. If you guys want to grab it that's one of the most common flowers in the game so if you can't get it i understand because a lot of people are full with them let's go up to roads there are a couple things there's a family heirloom right here at the edge of the post office right here at this location 
this item is a rosewood hairbrush. It was in a treasure chest right here at the edge of the building, so go grab that. Once again, that is a family heirloom. There's also a tarot card on the terrace at this location. You have to enter the terrace, go up the stairs, and there's like a little dining area, which that's the terrace. And in this dining area on one of the tables, you will find a Knight of Swords tarot card. There's also another tarot card right about here, sitting on a bench. Right on the side of this barn, you will find a Four of Cups tarot card. I have about one or two more things for you guys, which are up here by the peak. If you look at the lines, pay attention to the lines. Right here at this peak, you will find a scarecrow. And directly in front of that scarecrow, you will get a random lost jury if you come over there with your metal detector. And one more thing, which is a creek plum flower this creek plum flower is right here next to the d and pond right here at this location that's where you will find your creek plum flower so go get that as well why not that's pretty much all that i have for you guys currently right now today i don't know i may do a live stream. i may try to do a live stream or something like that i don't know because it's been like very glitchy lately so I feel like it, there's not really a point of doing a live stream because can't nobody see what's going on. But um, the cycles for today, once again, Wednesday, April 14th, are Family Heirloom Cycle 6, All Lost Jury Cycle 6, Coin Cycle 4, Arrowhead Cycle 5, Wildflower Cycle 3, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Tarot Card Cycle 2, Bird Egg Cycle 1, and Fossil Cycle 6. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 6, All Lost Jury Cycle 6, Coin Cycle 4, Arrowhead Cycle 5, Wildflower Cycle 6, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 4, All Terror Card Cycle 2, Bird Egg Cycle 1, and Fossil Cycle 6. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils. And how to spell the Twitter and Instagram, the name of the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. It's your main man, Hitman. I want to say, remember to like, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I do put out. Because I do put out videos each and every day. And try to join the live streams. Talk to me and all that stuff. Make it more, make, make it fun. <laughs> but, um... Thank you guys for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing, and everything else that you do for the channel. I do appreciate each and every bit of it. And like I said, it is your main man, Hitman. And I'm out.